I want my lawyer, Rick. Yeah? Well, you're gonna need one. Yeah, yeah. You got an eyewitness. The hotel made at John Durant's hotel. She overheard you promise to kill Durant if he laid a finger on Courtney. Durant threatened to ruin Courtney's reputation and even sent her to prison by indicting her for laundering mob money through her foundation. Now, I know you care about Courtney, and so you dealt with it the only way you know how. You wanted to protect her, so you shot him. A little sloppy this time, though. Characteristic professionalism kind of went right out the window. That is what happened, isn't it, Jason, huh? When Durant pushed your buttons by threatening Courtney, right? I'm not gonna talk with him, my lord. Okay. Well, justice is good. I'm sure I can prove this was a crime of passion. I'm sure get you in a sentence knocked down to 20 years. Officer, take Mr. Morgan here into interrogation one. Here's my dinner date is otherwise engaged. Yeah, hotel maid overheard Jason talking to John Durant. It seems Durant provoked Jason by threatening Courtney. If you're here to support Jason, I think you might be a little late. You're defending me. That's why the police brought you in here. I know. I can, I can handle this. Dad used me to provoke you, and I, now you're in all this trouble. Courtney, anyway. all you have to do is just run your foundation and live your life. That's what you wanted. That's all I want for you. I'm not just going to stand by while you go to prison. You, you, want, you want to help me? Just hold on to the life that you've made. Jason. Look, Jack's on me later, okay? There's something that I have to deal with before we take off. Damn. No! Jason, don't start in again. I'm not gonna sit around doing nothing when you've been arrested for something you didn't do. We have been over this. The cops have a strong case. Yeah, I know, and, and the only thing I can do for you is go home and take care of myself and the baby, right? No, wrong. It is my turn to look after you. I called justice to get you released. Yeah, well, I might not get released. Not only was a gun in my hand, now they have some hotel maid that has stepped forward. The case against me could go all the way to trial. Okay, well, at least you'll be out on bail, right? Yeah, Justin's gonna push for bail, but he may not get it, Sam. You, you need to plan on you know, being alone for a while. You gotta finish getting ready for this baby, okay? Go ahead, hire the nanny. I'll talk to my sister if you talk feel somebody... Talk to your sister? Wants... No, Jason, you are going to be there with me when this baby is born. That's what we planned, and that is what's going to happen. Yeah, well, Rick may have other ideas. Okay, well, then you need to prove you're innocent. So think back. Who was at the conference when, when the shooting started? Was there anyone close enough to Durant that could have could shot him? Anyone come in yeah. after it started? Yeah. What are you, Jason's lawyer now? You got knocked over last night. You could have lost the baby. I didn't. All I'm saying is you should be home resting, but you're at the PCPD. You're getting exhausted. Well, has you're it even occurred it. to you to ask me if I'm tired, Sonny? I'm not tired. Well, I, I come in here. You're arguing with Jason. You're I mean, the one arguing with I'm, right I'm not really arguing. Sam, I'm just kind of tired. Please. 
Will you just do me a favor and go home? Jason. Sam, I don't want to have to worry about you and the baby, okay? I, I am feel okay. a lot better I if you I am would... okay, honest. All right, please. Then you know what, Sonny and I have to talk business. Okay. You should have sent her home. Sonny, Sonny, I've, I've tried. Man, she's home. A lot alone. She doesn't like taking orders. Yeah, well, she should be taking care of herself. And then she's here, and I don't know. If things don't go my way on this, you're the only one she's going to be able to count on. Unless you get released. With what they've got on me? I tell you what, whoever framed you for shooting Duran it did a hell of a job. What he wanted to take out Durant and incriminate me, he probably hired a shooter from out of town. That's his usual MO. No, I remember seeing out because I had the press conference. And he was trying to make his way up to the front just before the shot was fired. Probably freaked when he saw Carly go to the podium. Couldn't stop the shooter in time. So the shooter was close. A reporter, maybe? A reporter? Uh, you know, I remember seeing this blonde up to my left. And I saw her with Alcazar before. Where? Outside of Kelly's in the morning of the shooting. So, he hired the blonde to shoot Durant and plant the gun on you? And all we have to do is prove it. It's not her heartbeat, it's hiccups. Hiccups? Yeah. Are you, are you uncomfortable? No. No, not at all. I'm actually, I'm, I'm kind of enjoying it. Okay. You better get used to seeing me around here, because if you don't get out on bail, I'm going to be visiting a lot. I might be out sooner than I expected. What? Did you find out who the shooter is? Uh, well, Sonny and I have a theory, but... But, um, what is it? All right, maybe I'll tell you. Tomorrow. If you go home and get some rest. <laughs>